We are Alex Stewart International and we provide international inspection and analysis services to the um, global commodity industry. We certify quantity and quality for anything that comes out of the ground. That could be metals and minerals or it could be agricultural products. We would also take samples. The samples would come back to our laboratories for analysis and we would determine the quality. We've expanded a lot in the last three years. We've invested over £10 million in the laboratory in Liverpool. We've also invested in our agricultural and food laboratories. We have a lot of work at the Port of Liverpool. We work 24-7 handling wood pellet biomass shipments from North America and Canada. As the Port of Liverpool uh, improves its infrastructure and increases its business with other countries around the world, our company also hopes to increase its inspection business at Liverpool as well as other ports in the UK. Smiley's is a family-run business. We've been exporting since 2003. We supply supermarkets overseas as well as food service companies, shops and also British embassies. We export a big range of chilled products but also frozen and grocery. We're selling the very British iconic ranges really, you know, the sort of products that expats would expect to see overseas, so PG Tips, Branston Pickle, Thai Foo and Heinz products, bird's eye, so yeah, big, big range of British products. We're very strong in the Middle East and Southeast Asia. That probably accounts for about 75% of our turnover, but we're, but we're also strong in the US and New Zealand. But also we're looking at various new markets as well. We've just been exhibiting at a food show in Nigeria, so we feel that's a good market for us, with lots of potential for British products. Park Energy uh, supplies, installs and maintains GE Yenbacher gas engines. We've been going since 1989 and we've been a Yenbacher distributor since 1995. We're now active in 25 countries around the world. We're, we're a major export of the equipment and our knowledge, if you like, and we offer customers savings and reliable power generation. Clark Energy hope to expand to even more countries. We've recently opened offices in the Midwest of the USA. Uh, we're keen to expand our footprint in the USA as we see that as a, a big potential market. True to form, the, the gas engine demand worldwide has increased and we've grown to meet that demand. ATG Access was founded in 1989, making predominantly products to prevent car crimes, so manual bollards and barriers. We developed into automatic bollards for use in the public highways to control cars in and out of city centres. But it was in uh, 2004 when there was uh, a change in the threat of terrorist attack in the UK that uh, the company really started to take off. Um, there was a new standard launched in the UK called PAS 68, which is a way of measuring the strength of vehicle barriers to show their ability to stop a jihadist terrorist attack. And ATG Access was the first company that ever successfully tested an automatic bollard and it stopped a seven and a half ton truck at 50 miles an hour. We recognised the need for our kind of products around the world. It wasn't a British product, it was something the whole world requires. Security is global. And we now export to over 60 countries in total and annually to 30, 35 countries.